Just want to do a quick video to show you how to turn a single gang box into a double or a triple. I don't think a lot of people know this. First video on the Electrical Board of Education. There we go. So, let me just get this in a position here without getting you seasick. So now, just as an example, what I want to do is I want to show how I can get a single gang box and I want to make it a double. All of a sudden you bought one, you got a few, you put it up there, you're thinking, okay, well, geez, I need a double now. I want to have two switches or you can buy the up and downs, but there's lots of reasons why you'd want to make it a double or even a triple. Any more than that, you can do as many as you want, but I would put support then. But two, you'd be okay to just go off of your original support. The sides, if you can see it, both sides have it, one screw that holds it together. So you just take that screw out and it, see how it goes and just slides in. Now you can do the same to this. because I have it mounted it's giving me issues because I got a wall here normally you wouldn't have that so now you can see how this just slides in that one in that hook that one in that hook Now you have a two gang box with nothing in the middle a solid two gang box one thing to keep in mind when you're doing it the only thing really to keep in mind is which side you're going because you can do either side one side has the tabs for where you're mounting it on drywall so if this side's already mounted it'll have the tabs there's no need to have the tabs out this side, so you can take the tab side off. So that way you only have one on the one side. But other than that, pretty straightforward. If you wanted to add a third, same thing. Take it off, add in another gang. There you go. Hope that helps someone. If it does, throw me a like, subscribe, you know the routine. And uh, keep an eye for more videos on the Electrical Board of Education, as I'm doing some stuff here, as you can see. So, uh, hope